Okay, we're back. So, funny story, my mother just popped in and told me she's been looking at graphics cards online, because I've been shopping for a new graphics card. And, you know, I've kind of picked one out. The problem is, well... Here we are. The incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts <clears throat> of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The problem is my portal oh, device on. should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. The problem is the motherboard on my PC doesn't have a PCI Express slot for some reason, so I'll have to find some other way to be able to use another graphics card. Can I save you? I think I can. Oh my god, I can. Sort of. Okay, that was weird. Whatever. And it blew up. <laughs> there it is. Hold on. <coughs> there. Good. You have a dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. <laughs> I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger <clears throat> person than that. I'm happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. More or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. But the important thing is you are back. With me. And now <sighs> I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing. For the rest of your life. After that, who knows. I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Sounds like an interesting hobby. <laughs> oh boy, I'm getting tired. Don't know why. Sorry about the mess. <clears throat> I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Oh my god, lasers! Not bad. That's okay, we're I safe. I forgot how good you are at this. <clears throat> Especially since I don't think the lasers can actually kill you. They just kind of knock you back. <sighs> oh boy. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be Wheatley. one in the corner. Wheatley, no, no, come back, no. Save me. Alrighty. Okay, that was a dumb idea. <clears throat> well done. Here come the <coughs> test results. Sorry about all you the coughing. You are a horrible person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Oh, boy. Oh.
Why must you blink so much, headset light? Don't let Seriously, that that's annoying. person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. <laughs> Okay. Too many variables. Okay. <laughs> Suckers walk. Exile. Don't even try. <laughs> <laughs> not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Oh, thanks. Oh, I'm tired. Whew. How's it going, 3DS? <clears throat> One moment. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Remember this part where I complained about how much Maleficent sucked? <laughs> Assuming anyone ever watched that video, I wouldn't blame you if you didn't. Hm. The fractions are more detailed in this game, which is funny because in Portal 1 you could change how detailed re reflections were, but in this game you can't. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Waddle over to the elevator and we'll continue the testing. <sighs> oh man, I keep yawning and I feel like I'm about to sneeze again. And I do not want to sneeze into the mic. Do not. <clears throat> And it's the exact a bit there. It looks like eggs. I'm hungry. <laughs> this next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faceplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Yeah. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. Oh, wow. Fun. Funny. <clears throat> Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass. Like by myself. Close at 16 for a second. All right, this isn't 16. There's no way. 
I'm having fun. Alright. We want yellow portal over there. Let's hope that's right. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling <clears throat> towards you. No, ball. Oh. <laughs> All right. We fun commentary yeah where you at? where are you you don't have to test with the garbage it's garbage press the button again all right secret message the only one in the game that I know of so far so it might be the only one in the game at all but whatever Faces of the moon. Let's give the moon a high five or something. I don't know. <laughs> All right. I just noticed the portals actually have a sound effect, like a sound effect when you stand near them. So like you can barely hear it unless you're like wearing headphones like me. We <clears throat> I'm having too much fun. I need to stop having fun. Fun just just isn't allowed. I'm sorry. No, you, you cannot have fun when watching my Let's Plays, I'm sorry. If you are having fun, you're doing it wrong. <clears throat> Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you, and I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Oh, thanks. Mm. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? Oh shit! <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Ow, ow. Okay. I wanted to see if I can just walk through it, but no, it still knocks you back. C can it be? Can it be? Is this, is this real? Is it? Oh. Aww. Yeah, I accidentally fizzled that before you could complete the test. I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. <laughs> oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. <clears throat> Cough, cough, cough. 
coughing all day. I like how the little things that the lasers go into playing music. It's not, I always thought that was a cool touch. Wait a second. The cube is playing music. Oh, wow. Well, usually the laser thingies do too. Laser thingies. I are intelligent. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle <coughs> test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. <laughs> we'll be together forever. Oh. I think that one was about to say, I love you. And they <coughs> are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. <laughs> this next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area. It did not have one. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Oh no. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There. If you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test oh. on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. That was a line from Moby Dick. <laughs> Alright. <coughs> oh, shit, I'm a moron. <laughs> Say anything? Okay, whatever. Figured she would say something after finishing that. She probably is supposed to, but didn't happen. Whatever. <coughs> hey, look, new chapter. That means time to break into another video. As soon as I press the F9 key. Where is the F9 key? F9, F9. There you are. Beautiful son of a bitch. <laughs> 